Welcome back to Eat the Race. This is week 119, day four. Defense results. We got two more failures, and unfortunately, we lost full points again. So that's 100 points between two matches. It's just so much. Like this team has, like, since I got Sothis to plus 10, 90 points have been like the most I ever lost. And now I'm losing like 130 so far. It's just so many points. Ugh. I really need to get a hell. Like, she's the only defense mythic I'm missing currently. So, uh, but yeah, let's take a look. This is uh, Nakayari or Nakayuri. So they got duo, uh, met duo duos, two duos. So we got this plus one, plus five harmonic tiki um i don't even know what her base kit is but drive attack reposition moon boom plus two current uh reposition in speed red solo basically the exact same build i'm running also plus speed just like mine at least i have one more merge plus three mela uh shield defense smite ether ning nin Nin Lin with Reposition, Death Flow, Disarm Trap. And a plus two Peony with Death Blow, okay. Uh, speed and Attack Tactics and Mumbo. Alright, so Disarm Trap means she can step on all the traps she wants without any problem. Set up. Good thing I do have that um, tactics room there. Doesn't work good against my place like this, but Go for it. yeah, this is Nin Lin. She all she does is kill things. But I'll this plus 32 attack and plus 13 speed. Where does she get plus 32 attack? I don't even remember what Tiki's weapon does because it's she's like such a rare unit to see. What does her weapon do and do? Like effective against dragons, but it doesn't matter because Sotis negates that. Like if bonus is active grass attack speed plus six during combat. And also attack equals bonuses on units during the when he defense and rest times 1.5. Oh yeah, she has like a half blade home, so that's like plus seven point five, I guess. Yeah. No, times 1.5, so that's 5 and 5, so that's like 15 attack on top of that 6, on top of the other 6, so yeah, this is, and she, she has 60 attack, without even summoners push, this is gross, but yeah, so they continue, oh, man, you're a wonder. take out Aspel, The news Tiki's dance ability to dance Len. Go for it. Take a brown one. And then use Len's self ability. I'm not sure I can courage Florina. To just block off. So even like if you have like a dual hero, it would have to have been one of the two that they left left in order for this not to work. Because I guess this is per, this is a pretty good team even against like dual hindrance teams. And yeah, they take a Eldigan and they just leave a Sarah trap, which is fine, I guess. Like it's, it's a lot of it's very difficult like to leave spots like this like some most of the times you end up with a hero that gets stuck I'll like this especially a range hero so yeah i mean this team is really strong like it, with just one dancer this limb was able to attack once get dance by peony attack twice gets dance by tiki's by with her ability to attack three times then self dance to attack four times so 
then these guys have a one in defense. But this is Midori, and they brought the one thing I wanted to see the most, a Hector, because I, like, ever since I put Aspel in this team, I wanted to see if he could work as a, like, I put him as a br uh, Brave Hunter counter, but I have, he has never fought a Brave Hector till today, so I really wanted to see if it works. So we have this fray over here, uh, reposition, noon time, embracing stance. It's uh, summoner supported, plus 10 flowers, Hector with a uh, special fighter, Ether, attack smoke, and distant defense. Plus 3, plus 4 Peony, Fury Wings, Mercy, Gold Flyers, and Aerobatics with Mumbo. Plus 10, plus 6. Uh, four star resplendent Sophia. Why not go with a five star? I, I don't get this. Uh, reposition either triangle adept, quick repose, attack speed, uh, attack defense solo, and attack smoke. So, yeah, TA Sophia is super good. Um, like if you're gonna go with a TA mage, I think Sophia does much better than uh, Leon with a triangle adept set. And a plus three, plus nine, uh, Air with Temari, Smite, Fury, Attack Death Link, and Rest Tactics. So yeah, Sophia with Triangle Adept, just... Yeah, hey, Brandmon can't do much against her. And she's so slow that she doesn't even get double anyway, so... Well, slow enough to avoid being doubled by Brandmon's auto-double. So here we go, Asbol is going to take on Hector. And a non-special fighter variant would have died to the uh, special, but Sot is able to get him out of the way. So here they decide to push to kill Sothis and I guess to heal a little bit. Plus, they're also inflicting attack smoke on Aspel. They push him up. Is they're hoping he survived one hit, but yeah. They forgot Sarah heals, and now he does even less damage. So yeah, Asbel works as a Hector counter, which is good because like this team, the problem is it used to get destroyed by Hectors. Like my last light team uh, defense for Dark, yeah, my Dark defense team before this one it used to get destroyed by Hectors all the time. Now it's just getting destroyed by Triangle of Death Sophia's, but because she counters Asbel as well, so. So yeah, there goes Aspel. And now we get left is both of our uh, dancers, Tekamikaya. At least she's able to fight back a little bit. If she had like, if I've been able to get time pulse for her, it would have been better. Stop it. She could at least get that glimmer off in one hit. And yeah, Sophia is never gonna kill Eldigan at full health. Like even even a green mage is not even able to kill him at full health. And this she has strangled death, so there's no way. A cruel dream then. Yeah. So you're able to take on the gold, so The problem is just bonfire takes so long to charge. And yeah, when he's this weak, his weapon is no longer active, so Peony can just finish him off. But yeah, um, 
So let's go on to offense. Um, we didn't check to see if they were all ready. Should be. I don't believe I mess with anybody's kid, but I said that before. Uh, Mila? No. What's the difference between this one and this one? Yeah, Mila. Um... We haven't had a chance to use this team yet. Alright. Uh, double up. Let's go. AKA 2 Hunter. Haven't I seen this name before? Yay! Cab line. Do I even have a cab line team this week? I guess the Beloria and Leon team is the best one for cab lines. So we got Sothis, plus six, plus three, life and death three, hardy bearing wings of mercy, so not as good as mine. Veronica, sorry, I had to cut that out. I mean, it doesn't really matter if I had left it in, it's just telemarketer's number, so whatever. I really hate when people call in the middle of a recording, but I can't like turn it off because it could be like family or stuff. So Pain, Restore, Miracle, Speed, plus 3, and Savage Blow. Plus 4, Rolf. Uh, 48 speed, pretty good. Hell. Reposition, HP attack 2. Claude. Harsh Command. This might come into play because they are going to get Panic. So he should Harsh Command Ethelin. So I got spaces to hide three units, one, two, and three. And four over here. There's no dancers, so. There's two, yeah, two healers, and those are the more annoying things to deal with. But with air, I can break this. And I could beta Rolf, Claude, or Ethelin. Well, Rolf and Claude. So this team can just destroy both Rolf and Claude, no problem, like Salif will just eat Claude alive. Uh, this team is not really good because this is more of an offense team. Uh, this team, Grima should be able to handle Rolf with a solo skill, so her speed is enough. Or I can even just have her tank Adelin and just put Corin over here. This team is... there's no mages. Well, I guess there's the healers. So we'll have to separate, like... Either get hit by Adelin... Even if she panics me, it doesn't really matter if I don't bring buffs. But Edelgar can counter, so she doesn't have this encounter, she has this on ward. And then this team again, uh, Beloria, sh yeah, Beloria should be able to handle. So I could put. Leon over here to take on Ethelin. Or Leon over here to take out Claude. Beloria to take on uh, Rolf. But then what do I do with Corin? Because she won't be able to attack. Because I need Beloria's speeds. Uh... I guess I could put him right here. Beloria should be able to take on Claude. Debuffs. As long as I don't buff, then I don't get debuff. Corrin is the one that eats these things anyway. So I could put like Mela right here. 
These are restore traps too, right? So yeah, it's a double restore trap with harsh commands. Mm, it's a very interesting thing. Just not sure who to go with. I think going with this team is probably the best. It's not Dancer, so it's not like the restores units do anything other than just be annoying. But I want to get rid of as many units as possible. Your Fortified Cavalry and your War Cavalry. So you don't get any buffs from him. So it's either this team or this team. It's just... I guess Mila can take a hit from something as well. I mean, she... She's bulky enough to survive most hits. Even from like this Veronica or the Satlin. But I kind of want to at least get rid of one of these healers. So the only thing that gets rid of healers is this team. So we'll go with blessing. this team. Alright, so Peony is the one that buffs. Well, first let's see what buffs you have right here. No buffs, no buffs, no more. buffs, like this. Mila buffs, okay, so we can just put Peony over here, Corin right here, and Mila right here to shut down this harsh command, that way I can force Claw to attack, and then Valoria 44 speed, 44 speed, you have a lol, but I also have a lol in my weapon anyway, you double debuffs, but what debuff am I, is she gonna pick up? 52, 54? I guess she will pick up uh, Panic, but yeah, Panic activates, but I don't, there's no debuffs, so there's no, I should be fine with that. I can bring you down here for the sole purpose of Stopping this harsh command because this restore I guess this restore still happens. So hold on, let me see what debuffs they got. No, actually no, this is good because you don't have a restore target because you cannot reach anyone. And Claude has to attack because he can be restored. So this is good. So after that, after Claude moves, then I guess Edlin can choose to heal Hell if he she wants. Which way to go? And yeah, you're never gonna be able to outspeed my Corin anyway. Then I can just use Peony to break this, and next turn I can just bring you over here. She will come, she won't even move, she'll just restore, no, she can't restore Rolf either, because he has no debuffs, okay. Home Cavalry. Hey, yeah, you have oh, War Cavalry? Home Cavalry, but why isn't it working on him? Oh, it won't activate till your turn. I'm dumb. So yeah, you'll be debuff. You'll be panicked, but so she'll restore you. I still think is the best method of going is like this. Since we can't get rid of this, but it doesn't matter if we have no buffs. It will be done. All right. The only pro, the only thing is work. that Valoria is not gonna be able to have her uh, 
solo active, but we should be fine still. I bestow my blessing. All right. Put Mila over here. Okay. Gloria here. Ready. We'll break this. Yeah, we don't want to get let Veronica hit us because she'll take away negating fang. All right, there goes Edlin. Do you challenge me? All right, that worked just like I wanted. So long, Wolf. He didn't even get restored. Bye bye, Claude. Happy New Year. Oh, yeah, I guess she did restore. That's why she's over here. All right, so let's get rid of her. Hopefully. I think there's no other target. She attacks. Keep up. So we can put you here. Put you here. Hmm. Reposition you over here. Back to work. Break this now. It'll Break this done. now. Uh, we can get Peony out of there. And there's. I'm outside the Panic Manor range. I'm still taking this infantry school, but now Ready. I can do this. Because I can still get the. I can still get him some buffs. And I'll break this. Of course, you're gonna be an in that attack. I wish I could force you to attack with Mila, but tear them to shreds. Yeah, not gonna happen. Mm, Peony is in a bad spot right now. Good morning. I guess we're everybody right second now. over here. We're. Uh, I still misclick even when I finally like go this. with the click to move thing. Can Veronica Ready. kill Peony? Maybe this way. I don't think so. I don't think she has the Keep damage up. for it, but I don't Tear need to move to Leon shreds. out of the way though. This will lead them there for now. Just need to start moving toward the ether, and these things are very annoying. Not letting me move. Yeah. Veronica is just being annoying. Happy New Year. Can I get rid of hell right here? Hmm. Mystic boost. It doesn't really, it wouldn't even matter, but now I do need to find a way to keep moving forward, keep bro, uh, Peony safe and dealing with you all over. Oh man, it's gonna be annoying, but you're just gonna keep restoring. You are not gonna attack unless I find a way to get you to attack. Back to work, yeah. This is too much to even. Good morning. You do enough damage, so at the very least that's good. But then I'll have to deal with you just being annoying everywhere. I bestow my blessing. One, two, three. No, you'll kill Mila if I step on this trap. Maybe this way. Which way to go? Alright, let's just kill this hell, I guess. Ready. 
kill you right here. Okay. Get you out of the way. Keep up. Destroy this. 40 speed, 40... Okay, you'll be okay just because of your solo skill. Tear them to shreds. It will be done. How many turns do I have left? Three turns to get the ether. She won't attack Leon. Keep moving forward. And I can put you right here. Like this. Move you over here. Maybe move you right here. Back and move work. you right here. Does she have miracle? Yes. What now? Right. I bestow my Get this. Keep up. Get this ether. Which way to go? Do you have Wings of Mercy? Yes. So, either this trap does enough damage to put me in, if it either is not the real trap, I kill Veronica. Is the real trap, it does enough damage to put me into Wings of Mercy and I kill Veronica. Or it doesn't do enough damage for me to be in Wings of Mercy, which means Veronica doesn't do enough damage to kill me. All right. Very annoying. Just Veronica was being super annoying again. Because Veronica will always be annoying. Just running around, killing, never attacking. All right. So we managed to survive that cab line. All right, let's see how everybody else is, who has played by now, is doing. All right, in first place is Oron, and then Promise just jump into first, uh, second place. I guess she must have played twice today. I haven't been, uh, checked her video yet. I did saw her summoning session though when she plus ten this cloud. I guess she hasn't spend any mangoes to change hers uh whatchamacallit uh traits erica from new swordsman so new swordsman also jump play pretty high kako ucla matt ren recadol remless uh dogs there's us dark gluster and brave blitz michael Sushi, Luis, 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 and then Sub Bolt of Heaven, Ghosting, Diego, Bean, and Larcy Guy. But yeah, this thing's like I never seen her on offense, so I didn't even know that she could hit that freaking hard. Um, don't believe there's anything to summon today but we can check no not someone today all right so that's pretty much it so thank you all for watching i'll see you next time bye